Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to share with you my entire Kino Lorber movie collection. Uh, a couple videos ago I talked about um, some Kino Lorber, actually it was an older video from 2019 where I talked about my first Kino Lorber order. Um, as a company, uh, Kino Lorber is great. They, they are restoring and adding some special features in many cases to many of the older movies and I absolutely love this company. One of the things that you'll see is if you order from them around Christmas time I think around the holidays they will send you a catalog. I don't get much paper catalogs in the mail anymore but I absolutely love this catalog. And I'll just show you the inside of it. I just love reading the descriptions of the movies and things like that. Everything's all categorized. So this is great. If you order from Kino Lorber, you would get one of these around the holidays. And I think this last round, I got two of these, which is great. So I'm just going to go through these. I probably won't talk about them too much, but, uh, but I wanted to show you my entire collection. First one I'm going to show is, uh, I don't think I mentioned this on the channel, but I'm a huge uh, theater fan. This is a Chekhov. This is a movie version of a Chekhov play called Three Sisters. Here's the front and the back of that. One of the things I'll mention in the beginning too is Kino Lorber typically has a black label. I'll show you one of the other movies. But in this case, they've moved to this other label. I kind of like the, um, the black label just because I can find all the Kino Lorber videos in my, in my collection. Here's another one that is a movie version of a Eugene Ionesco play called Rhinoceros with Gene Wilder, Zero Mostel. Of course, they were in the producers together. There's some extra features on here. Again, another play, Edward Albee's A Delicate Balance with Katherine Hepburn and Paul Schofield. Again, some of these special features are great, which you don't really see. Interview with Edward Albee, interview with the cinematographer. Um, so lots of extra features that you may not see. I don't think this was on Blu-ray before. So uh, thanks to Keenan Lorber for putting that on Blu-ray. This is a Eric Romer movie called Pauline at the Beach. Hard to find. I, I picked up a lot of these um, during the sale. So Kino Lorber does a number of different sales. They may do some sales that have a theme to them too. So um, Kino Lorber has great documentaries also. This happens to be a Ramdas Timothy Leary documentary with lots of bonus uh, features on them. Jane Fonda movie, They Shoot Horses, Don't They? Uh, it's actually a Sidney Pollack uh, film, but Jane Fonda's features it, uh, featured in it, of course. And here's the front and the back of that one. Uh, this movie, uh, Lost Highway, the David Lynch movie, um, I think there was some controversy last year about whether David Lynch actually approved this release, but it's nice to see Lost Highway on a Blu-ray. Jim Jarmusch film called Broken Flowers with Bill Murray. It's another great release. I don't believe it had a Blu-ray release before this. Uh, please leave a comment if you know any different too. If I say something that may be incorrect, you may know differently on this too. Um, another Mike Nichols film called Silkwood with Meryl Streep, Kurt Russell, and Cher. Great movie. Uh, this movie I remember seeing, I think when I was a kid, it's called Folks and it's with Roger Moore. And... Um, uh, James Mason and Anthony Perkins and I haven't seen this in quite a while but I do remember seeing it uh, when I was younger and then some of these you may have seen before again I'm going back to the black label um, Kino Lorber this is a an early Robert Altman film called The Long Goodbye highly recommend it if you're a Robert Altman fan this is a great movie some special features on the back there I've talked about these before too in the other um, haul video Gator with Burt Reynolds Got these during a sale too. Here's White Lightning also. Front and back of that one. Uh, one of my favorite movies with Ernest Borgnine, Marty. Highly recommend this movie if you haven't had a chance to see it. Again, I talked about it in my other haul video. One of my favorite films from the 1970s, The Taking of Pelham 123. There was a remake of this movie. This is a 42nd anniversary edition of it. Kind of a random year, I guess. But this is a great movie with Walter Matthau, Robert Shaw, um, Martin Balsam, Hector Elizondo. Great, great movie from the 70s. Walter Matthau and the Laughing Policeman. 
There's the front and back of that one. This is an Alfred Hitchcock film, uh, Lifeboat, which hasn't really been on any other collection that Kino Lorber put out. It's a great film. It's a great Alfred Hitchcock film. Uh, as you might remember, if you've seen this film, you know Alfred Hitchcock makes a very unique appearance in it. So highly recommend this one. I'm getting into some that I've shown before already. This is The Doctor with William Hurt. Got this uh, during a sale. It's a great movie. This is a John Frankenheimer movie called 52 Pickup. Kind of a, um, not his most well-known film, but I think it's a great movie. This is an early, this is an early Hal Ashby film called The Landlord. Um, this is a great, a great film. I'm looking to collect as many Hal Ashby films as I can. And finally, another theater release, The Iceman Cometh. This has been on a few collections. Um, this is on a DVD, uh, which was a little bit less expensive, but it's got a lot of extra special, it's extra special. It's got a lot of special features on it, uh, interviews and things that you may not see. Again, this is uh, from the theater. So thanks for watching today. That's my entire complete Kino Lorber collection. I'm sure I'll be ordering more Kino Lorber in the future. Highly recommend this company. They're doing such a great job with releasing older movies restored with extra features. It's a great, great uh, company. So highly recommend you add some of their movies to your collection. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Click on like if you like this video. Uh, if you, if you want to see me do more collection videos, I'd be happy to do those. So let me know what you'd like to see. If you have questions or comments, feel free to uh, leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.